Hello, and welcome to the very first episode of Next Level Homebrew. I'm Nick McCoy. My name is Father Jeff Perot. And today we're going to introduce you to a little bit of who we are and what we do, but mostly about what the subsequent episodes are going to be about. Now, Nick and I have known each other for probably about 17 years now. Long time. Long time. And at least over probably the last 14, maybe 15 years, um, he and I have both uh, spent a lot of time and energy and, and effort in pursuing one of our, our passions, which is great craft beer. Now, our, you know, our, our, our travels have taken us all over the world. We're talking Pilsner Arkell in the Czech Republic, uh, Oktoberfest in Munich twice, uh, all the great Trappist breweries, West Flader and West Mala, Ockel. I went to Fuller's in London, even some things back in the U.S. Oh yeah, we came back here to the U.S. and we, uh, we'd go to places like Sam Adams, Allagash, Dogfish Head, Flying Dog, Sierra Nevada, Ballast Point, okay. Russian River. They got, they got, they got. <laughs> Basically, we've gone from you know, East Coast to West Coast, never were in between, seeking out great craft beer. So about 10 years or so, I can't remember if I got a kid or Jeff got a kid or how we got started. But some of us got a kit for Christmas and we started making beer at home and it turned out pretty well. Uh, a little rough at first, but um, we started thinking, could we make this great beer at home? Now, you know, a lot of you, is, is, is same thing happened with us. When you first start in homebrewing and you tell your family and friends about it, you know, they first are kind of like, oh, okay, that's nice. You're making your own beer. <laughs> this is going to taste horrible. <laughs> but then a lot of times as they taste that first batch that you make, they you know, a lot of times the response is, hey, that wasn't half bad. But Nick and I had some, kind of the same experience, but the question that we always asked after every batch we made, and even to this day of every batch that we make, we always ask ourselves, okay, this was good, but how can we take this beer to the next level? So about 10 years or so, we began entering competitions. Here in Dallas, we've got a great competition called the Blue Bonnet Brew Off. Oh, cheers. Uh, and we had pretty good success pretty fast. Um, but more importantly, we got some really good comments and feedback, which helped us to fine tune our recipes. Then three years ago, we started entering in the national homebrew competition. And initially, we did all right. I mean, we made it through the first round with some which of our great, beers. Which is great. Oh, it was very good. Um, but we never could get much past that until this year. And this past year, we got a gold or first place for our, uh, our Belgian quad in the Belgian Dark Strong category. We also got a first place for our Black IPA in the Specialty IPA category, which actually won us the Ninkasi. <laughs> ah, yes. So what are we doing here today on this camera? It's a great question. Mm. Um, what we're doing here today is that we want to not only uh, brew some of the styles that we made, or that we won awards for, in particular the, um, you know, the Black IPA and the Belgian Quad that we won at uh, the National Homebrewers Conference and, and competition for, but we also want to take you through our other award-winning beers, and we want to have a time in which you can uh, collaborate with us, mm -hmm. ask us questions, and hopefully learn some things from us, and, uh, and we can learn some things from you. And we'll have a lot of that through your suggestions and comments down below. Now, this is definitely next level home brewing, duh, but it is not how to brew. Uh, John Palmer, uh, Brewing Network, Northern Brewer, all those guys have done a much better job, much better looking guys than we are. Uh, have done much better videos than probably we could ever do. So if you're just starting out, please look at those videos mm -hmm. first. Get that first extract kit or maybe even go all grain to start and get that underneath your belt. Um, but this is just some good informational videos to kind of show you what we do. Um, and be a little bit of like a, a vlogging episode where we can talk about things we're making, new recipes or all those kind of things. Exactly, because we want this to be a collaborative experience. Um, we want it to be something in which not only can you learn from us, but we learn things together. So if you like this video, please like it, share it with your buddies, subscribe, leave us comments below and tell me how we're doing. But until we see you next time, cheers. Cheers. Happy homebrew.